Hey everyone, and welcome back for another deep dive. Yay! You know her, you love her. The legendary Lara Croft is back in the spotlight. And this time it looks like things are going to be bigger and bolder than ever before. Right. Like, honestly, when I saw these articles about Amazon's plan for a whole Tomb Raider universe, I was floored. Yeah. It's not just a new game or a movie this time. Exactly. We're talking a full-blown franchise. A series. A film. And they're even hinting at potential games, like they're really going all out. It seems like Amazon's making a play to rival those massive franchises like Marvel or Star Wars, you know? Yeah, I mean, think about what those have done for Disney and HBO Max. Having that kind of powerhouse franchise is a game changer in the world of streaming. Oh, absolutely. And it looks like they're putting a lot of thought into how to build this universe the right way. Yeah, the articles mention this transmedia approach, which is super interesting. So basically, it's like telling the Tomb Raider story across different platforms. Right. Like, imagine playing a game that directly ties into the series or reading a comic that expands on a character's backstory. So it's not just about watching a show or playing a game. It's about being fully immersed in this world. Exactly. And that's something we haven't really seen done on this scale before. I think that has the potential to be really groundbreaking. I agree. If they can pull it off, it could change the way we experience entertainment. It's like they're tapping into how our relationship with entertainment is evolving. We, we don't just want to passively consume anymore. We want to be active participants. We want to explore and dive deeper into the stories we love. And this Tomb Raider universe seems like it's offering that opportunity. But let's talk about the woman at the center of it all. Lara Croft herself. So the rumors are swirling that Sophie Turner from Game of Thrones is the front runner for the role. Wow, now that's some casting. Right, and it makes sense when you think about it. She's got the experience playing strong female characters in these massive franchises. Exactly, and she can definitely handle those action-heavy roles. But what I'm really curious about is how she'll bring her own style to such an iconic character. Yeah, Lara Croft has been portrayed in so many different ways over the years. It'll be interesting to see what Turner brings to the table. It seems like they're looking for someone who can really embody Lara's evolution, not just the action hero, but her vulnerability and depth. Right, like a fully realized character. And from what we're reading, it sounds like Turner really impressed them with her screen tests. Especially her ability to show both strength and vulnerability, which seems to be a key focus for this reboot. I mean, that makes sense. Lara's always been more than just a tough girl with guns. Exactly. She's a complex character with a lot of depth, and it sounds like they really want to explore that in this new series. I think that's a smart move. Audiences are looking for that kind of depth in their heroes these days. Okay, so we've got this ambitious plan for a whole Tomb Raider universe and a potential star to lead the charge. But there's one more piece of the puzzle we need to talk about. The creative mind behind it all. Phoebe Waller-Bridge. The Emmy-winning creator of Fleabag and Killing Eve. She's stepping into the world of action and adventure. Which is a really interesting move considering her background. Right. Like, she's known for these sharp, witty, character-driven stories. But she's also no stranger to action. She co-wrote No Time to Die and even had a role in the new Indiana Jones film. So she's definitely got the chops for this kind of project. And what's really cool is that she's a huge Tomb Raider fan herself. Oh, yeah. She even called Lara Croft a touchstone from her youth. Which tells me she has a deep understanding of the character and the franchise. That's always a good sign. And her vision for the series is really intriguing. Yeah, she's aiming for this blend of nostalgia, capturing that classic 90s feel, but with fresh and modern storylines. That's a tough balance to strike. For sure. But if anyone can do it, it's Waller Bridge. I mean, her track record speaks for itself. She's got this incredible talent for creating characters and stories that really connect with people. And I think she could bring something really special to Tomb Raider. Okay, so we've got Sophie Turner potentially stepping into Lara Croft's boots, Phoebe Waller-Bridge at the helm, and Amazon going all in on building this massive Tomb Raider universe. It's a lot to take in. Yeah, but it sounds like it could be amazing. I'm definitely intrigued. Me too. So what do you think? Are you excited about this Tomb Raider reboot? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. We'd love to hear what you're hoping to see from this new era of Tomb Raider. It's clear that Amazon sees a lot of potential in this franchise and they're not afraid to invest in it. It's a smart move, really. The streaming landscape is so competitive these days. Right, like every platform is trying to find its own flagship franchise. Like you said before, Disney has Marvel and Star yeah. Wars, HBO Max has Game of Thrones and DC. So for Amazon, Tomb Raider could be their ticket to the big leagues. Yeah, exactly. It already has a dedicated fan base and a ton of history to draw from. And with this fresh new vision, 
they can really expand that audience. I think that's what makes this whole thing so fascinating. It's not just about revising an old franchise. It's about pushing the boundaries of what's possible in entertainment. And that's where this transmedia approach comes in. It's like they're building a whole ecosystem around Tomb Raider. You could watch the series, then dive into a game that continues the story. Or maybe read a comic that delves into a specific character's backstory. It's about giving fans multiple entry points into this world. And allowing them to experience it in a way that feels personal and engaging. If it can really pull this off, it could be a game changer. No doubt about it. Okay, so we've talked about the ambitious scope of this Tomb Raider universe and the potential star power behind it. But let's not forget about the creative vision driving it all. Phoebe Waller-Bridge is a really interesting choice to lead this reboot. I mean, she's coming from a background of these witty, character-driven comedies. Right, but she's also shown that she can handle action and adventure. And she's a genuine Tomb Raider fan. So she's approaching this project with a lot of passion and understanding. And she's not afraid to take some risks. The articles hint that she's really diving deep into Lara Croft's character. Exploring her motivations, her vulnerabilities, what makes her tick. It sounds like we might get a more nuanced and emotionally resonant portrayal of Lara than we've seen before. Which I think is really exciting. Audiences are looking for that kind of depth in their heroes. And Waller Bridge is a master at creating characters who are both strong and flawed. If she can bring that same sensibility to Lara Croft, this reboot could be something truly special. I think so too. Yeah. But of course, there are always challenges when you're rebooting a beloved franchise. You've got to find that balance between honoring the original and bringing something new to the table. And there are definitely some fans who are worried about how Waller Bridge's comedic style might translate to the Tomb Raider world. Yeah, some people are concerned that it could turn into a parody. While others are excited to see what fresh perspective she brings. It's a valid concern, but I think it all comes down to respect. Respect for the legacy of Tomb Raider. But also recognizing that it needs to evolve to stay relevant. It's about finding that sweet spot between the past and the future. And that's where Waller Bridge's talent comes in. She's known for her ability to blend humor and drama in a way that feels authentic and engaging. And she's got the vision, the experience, and the passion to make this Tomb Raider reboot something truly special. It's a risky move, for sure. But risk often leads to the most rewarding results. And if they can strike that perfect balance? This Tomb Raider reboot could be the start of a whole new era for the franchise. I think what's really got people talking is the idea that this reboot might delve deeper into Lara Croft's character. You know, like, really explore what makes her tick. That's what I'm most excited about, to be honest. Me too. We've seen Lara as this badass action hero for years. But there's so much more to her than that. Exactly. She's a complex character with a rich backstory. The articles mention that Waller Bridge is particularly interested in exploring the impact Lara's past has had on her. You know, like how her experiences have shaped her into the woman she is today? It sounds like we might see a more vulnerable side to Lara in this reboot. Which I think is a really smart move. Audiences today are looking for characters who feel real and relatable, even if they're raiding tombs and fighting ancient gods. Exactly. We want to see their flaws, their vulnerabilities, their humanity. And Waller Bridge is a master at creating characters like that. Characters who are both strong and flawed, witty and vulnerable. If she could bring that same magic to Lara Croft. This reboot could be something truly special. So it all comes down to this, can this Tomb Raider reboot capture the spirit of the original while also bringing something new and exciting to the table it's a tough challenge but i have faith in phoebe waller bridge i do too she's got the vision the experience and the passion to make this something great and with amazon's backing this could be the start of a whole new era for tomb raider one that honors its past while paving the way for an exciting future so what do you think about all of this are you excited about the tomb raider reboot what are your hopes and maybe even some concerns? Hit us up in the comments. We'd love to hear your thoughts.